embarrassing. <laughs> Go on. Depends how they touch Answer you, doesn't that question. it? <laughs> what do you mean it depends how they touch you? Like, I think if you're stroking in the right point mm. of the body... Anyone could arouse anyone, surely. Yeah, that's a good point. It's just like you yes. wouldn't want to go through with the actual act of sex mm. with someone that you're not compatible but would, with. But I wouldn't like a girl touching me. It would freak me out. But if yeah. you were if blindfolded, blindfolded yeah, you're right. had um, your ears covered yeah. and a girl was going down on you, yeah. then it would be the same as a guy. That's true. Probably actually. better because you'd probably understand her way around yeah. a bit better. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I'm just theorising here. Let's not talk about that again. Um, (laughs) No, you're right, actually. So you're agreeing with Sam. What was his point? His point was a question, No, but his point was completely stupid. Sam never has a point. Like, as if gay guys are actually really attracted to women was basically what what Sam I think that's what he was getting at. Yeah. Wasn't he trying to say, like, could he get aroused by a guy? Was that the question? No. It, It was him misunderstanding what being gay was. He's a fucking moron. Uh-huh. Well, we know that. Thick as fuck, as, uh-huh. he, as he says himself. Uh-huh. And, but then Ellie said to him, if a guy touched you, would you get hard? And he went, I'd go get off. <laughs> He'd probably go, if you can fucking get, I'll fucking like, knock your lights out or whatever. Yeah, he <laughs> would. Um, is this about when they had the conversation about the most embarrassing thing you've oh, ever yeah. done? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Ellie said that she did a shit in a lift. Mm-hmm. That's nice. Yeah. Did Sam have one? Sam headbutted his date, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> I have no more okay. context on that. Uh, What's the most embarrassing thing you've ever done, Gaz? <laughs> I knew this was going to come up. <laughs> Don't, because I haven't of, thought of it. You should have thought of an answer, No, then. I haven't got one. It was mm-hmm. not shit in a lift, that's for sure. <laughs> Actually, I'm not really embarrassed by much, are you? No, I'm not. I just think, oh, fuck it. I don't give a shit. I've got a sewing needle lost inside my arm. I suppose that's a bit embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> Lost inside your arm. Yeah, because I lent on it and it went in my arm. <laughs> Did you not know that? No. I, look, I'll show you the scar. Oh, yeah. You see that scar? Yeah. It so was, it went into you yeah, so was, deep you couldn't it, find it. Yeah, it was sticking out the sofa. I was actually picking my nails with it. Oh, and God, I lent on it. I'm sitting on this, this uh, sofa. No, it was years ago. I lent on it and it got lost all the way inside. And then the doctors couldn't find it. And I had to have a, a general anaesthetic. Because <laughs> it got lost inside my body. <laughs> God, I wish I had something embarrassing like that. I haven't got one. Well, it's not that, it wasn't that great at the time. It was quite painful. <laughs> um, <laughs> what next? Game of which housemate am I? Oh, hold on. When's, I put this will only end in a row. What? When Sam said he headbutted his date, Ellie went, was she fit? <laughs> She's being jealous over that yeah. date. That <laughs> retrospectively <Yeah>. jealous. <laughs> that is a weird. Ferrari or uh, what is she again? <laughs> Fiat Punto. Okay, what was this? Guess the house. Yeah, name. which housemate am I? Mm-hmm. So I think this might have been a task, actually. Mm-hmm. I could win Big Brother because mm. I could gain confidence by... And then mm. people had to, housemates had to fill in the answers. Right. It's a task that you clearly glazed over and uh, relied on me to fill in. No. <laughs> I've got, Hannah says Charlotte is too vocal now. <laughs> That's the only bit I've got yeah. too. And. <laughs> She's right. And then Hannah. A row kicked off with Andrew mm. spouting off between him and, and, between him and Hannah. He's always having a go at Hannah. And then he said. Pot kettle, pot kettle. Mm, he didn't dare say black. Yeah, <laughs> and then Hannah went, pot kettle, what do you mean? And yeah. he's like, it's a phrase or something, something like that. <laughs> but what was it all about? Um, Hannah told Andrew not to get involved with something. He said, don't point at me, that is so rude. You can do the accent. Don't point at me, that is so rude. That's good. They must, you must have a lot of good Andrew impressions this week. Actually, I'm feeling the pressure because people are expecting the Andrew impression. <laughs> like, um, He's been saying all sorts. Rawan was like, oh, you've got, you must have so much good material on, on yeah. Andrew from last night's yeah. episode. And I was just like, beyond like caring by that, the end of that episode last night, it was too much. It was too petty. Oh, well, that's the attitude. Petty. It's abrupt. <laughs> <laughs> and then what? Sam. Oh, I've got an eek. Charlotte's baggy top with a pineapple on it. Did you notice that? No, I didn't. Oh, know. horrible. It looks like something White D would wear. <laughs> <laughs> um, Sam was theorising that Chanel is trying to manipulate Ellie so that she can win. How? Mm. Did Sam say the word manipulate? 
I doubt it. <laughs> but I think he was wondering if, you know, when um, Chanel says to Ellie, oh, you're following, if you're in Sam's shadow, you're following Sam around. Mm. you got to, like, be your own person. Yeah. Is this because I like you? Yeah, because I'm your friend and that. God, that's a blur of Chanel and Ellie. <laughs> and Shelley. then <laughs> <laughs> Shelley. <laughs> and then Sam was, like, his, his theory was that, like, by putting taking Ellie's confidence down a notch yeah. she would be sort of elevating her own oh, image okay. in the house and well, it's not basically hard to take... trying to stifle Ellie it's not hard to take Ellie's confidence down is it no was mm. it my mum always says the same like, I'm always putting myself second best mm. or whatever Twat. Um, Charlotte and Hannah mm. had a storeroom chat to clear the yes, air yes I've got that but about what Hannah doesn't like Charlotte swearing oh yeah because she's getting too vocal now and oh, she's yeah. like yeah, yeah piping up um that's all i've got on that and then chanel was giving ellie a pep to oh yeah, this is the same why bit. do you you're beautiful why do you hang on <laughs> no no so, that's good was it, who yeah, was it though uh, chanel okay good yeah. <laughs> oh big big brother big brother <laughs> Pete, no, what was it and again hey man um you're beautiful why do you think you're second best mm. why can't you be on your own she said and then Ellie said, I don't want to be in a relationship. I'd hate to see her if she does want to be in a relationship. She does, though. Because she's, she's completely lying to herself. Mixed messages. Chanel said, I just see myself in you. And I've been there and I've o- always compared myself to people. And they were both mm. tearing up, weren't they, yeah. on the bench? No. I think their relationship is quite interesting because although they're not particularly good friends and Ellie nominated uh chanel this week spoiler but <laughs> i've always felt like they had a bit of a a connection in a way or a bit of an understanding or because they're both northern lasses yeah and it seems like they all on paper they should be good friends in a way even though they're not that's a love island phrase do you know that no on paper match on paper yeah yeah it's not a love island that's no a it, it is known phrase. but it's a love island thing primark have made t-shirts you've with been it watching on. love island no again. <laughs> i've seen it on the primark instagram <laughs> I like it on this morning when Rylan has to talk about Love Island. Does he? Yeah, and he like he acts all like, oh well, obviously I don't really know about this because you know I host Big Brother. It's like, oh please, get over yourself. Um, um, but yeah, uh, like, no, yeah, it, it seems they... like well, they're kind of of the same ilk yeah. in a way. In yeah. that, um, well, Chanel hasn't previously done. No, she has. Yeah, she has. Ex- yeah, not X on the beach. Oh, my. Something like that. Okay, they're, Wah! They're... Wah! Uh, yeah, <laughs> X on the beach. It is X on the beach. Okay, so they're both like second rate. Busty, mm. well, Ellie's not that busty, but they're both mm. wannabe reality Busted. northern girls. So yeah. I can see why they'd feel like sticking together. But mm. it does seem like they've never really become friends to me. No. Do you know what I mean? Like, maybe it's what do they talk maybe, about? Maybe there is a rivalry there. Then I don't think it's a rivalry. No. And I, when I think when Chanel says these things, she does want to look out for Ellie. I, I do, do but too. I do believe I do that. Too. I do too. But at the same time, sometimes I'm like, mm, but she also knows it's probably good TV. So it's hard mm. to tell with Chanel sometimes, True. as much as I like her true but when she said i see myself in you and i've been there i I believe that mm. I think that's genuine so i don't know who this is to but charlotte said oh, i think it might have been to ellie if you change anything about yourself because someone says something to you you're fucked does that ring a little bell with you if you change anything. if you change charlotte says if you change anything about yourself because anyone says something to you you're fucked do you remember an instant recently in the light when someone came in told charlotte something about herself stop sitting on the fence daddy says and she suddenly changed personality she grew some balls so apparently she's now fucked to be what? chopped by off by her own admission i just thought the irony of her saying that was quite delicious however <laughs> she did say to ellie yeah you should do whatever you want to do you should say whatever you want to say. Mm. Surely that's finally something you can agree on Gaz with Charlotte. Is, <laughs> we, is that your take of the week? Could be. Mm. I quite like it. Not bad. It's like balanced if you were mm. to do it in yeah. two lines. Yeah. It looks nice. <laughs> Particularly good in Arabic, maybe. <laughs> 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 Ellie said... <laughs> what? The next thing I've got is Sam and Ellie virtually rutting. <laughs> well, uh, at the end of that conversation, Ellie did say that she moved away from Sam for a few days. Mm-hmm. I felt like this storyline was kind of... Ellie couldn't make make up her mind about the way she wanted to go. Mm. She was like, with Chanel, she was like, OK, I appreciate this, I know what you're saying to me. And then with Charlotte, she was kind of like, mm. yeah, but how can she say that to me? And also going, 
I wish that she hadn't said that to me because a few mm. days ago I modified my behaviour and I moved away from Sam okay. because Chanel made me second guess myself. Did she fucked me away from him. Hold on, I'm worrying now because I invited of you. I have voted. Who's the, who's the favourite to go? Uh, you mean betting odds? Yeah. Oh, no, I haven't no. seen any. Who did you vote for? Ellie? I voted six times. Fucking hell, man. I know, only because I accidentally dialed the wrong number once. Earlier? Well, that's why, innit? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I vote... I ain't got a pot to, pit. <laughs> pot to piss in. I'm literally on, on my ass. ass. And you ain't, literally... on his, he ain't on his ass no more. Come on, who have you voted for? We He's need... not, is he? I voted twice for Ellie, mm. twice for Kieran, mm. twice for Tom, because I want Chanel no and Hannah. There's for fucking Kieran. No one's going to vote to a victim. I know, but... I want it's... Ellie to go. Who's the favourite to go out of, like, Twitter polls? I imagine shit? Ellie. I've seen one saying Ellie, but it was a vote of 11 oh, people, so it's not Ellie accurate. Again? How can we do it while we're well, doing Well, your podcast? phone is the one recording. We need to pause. Hold on, can I do it on here? What's the number? <laughs> that, has that got telephone function? No. <laughs> it's an iPad with... Hello? <laughs> <laughs> Can't you remember what a number is on your phone? You want me to do it again? Yeah, you do it. I'll give you the money. Okay. Write twice, though. Um, but what if you do the wrong one? Can you remember what's what a number What's a number? What's a number? Got your number. Oh, um, yeah, Six fifty. This is good podcast. Yeah, you have right to here. go into. Oh, Ooh, you have right. to go into um, the housemate profile. Six fifty. I ain't got it on my iPad. Fifty eight. I think it's 06. I ain't got it on my iPad. Oh, for fuck's sake! Okay, just bear with us while we get Lindsay's vote in. <laughs> I know very it's important because I want Ellie to go and Sam can fucking go with her and they can fucking chip off right. back to magazine. Housemates. Right, let's have a look. Magazine. Ellie. <laughs> magazine <laughs> Deal Island. Yeah. Um, and I think she's 06 yeah. yeah but are you sure mind you any of those people to go would be fine. 05 that would have been a wasted vote okay Do, dial twice if you a quid I've got money in, oh you know thanks for calling the big brother vote lines you have voted for Ellie woo one more, one more one more another pound this yes, I'm giving it to you sorry you bought me chips it's fine I know but you got to get the Uber did I say 05 or 06 05 fuck's sake yeah, oh five. <laughs> I think we're on form tonight. Hello, is that Emma Willis? I think this is like one of my legacy episodes. Thanks for Hi, Emma. Yeah, I'd like to register my vote for, for, for Ellie. Thank you, Emma. Bye. Hit me! Chef <laughs> <laughs> now. I'll be so happy if Ellie goes. Don't make it. It's a final. double tonight, you know that, right? No, is it? Oh, for fuck's sake, yeah. Oh, shit. Who else? Quit. Who else for? <laughs> Tom. This is costing me a fortune. Let's vote for Tom and all. Tom as well. Tom's... Kieran ain't going to go. I know who Tom is. Tom is 16 because he entered last. Kieran's a wasted vote. Vote for Tom's wife. 650, 58, 16. I've got two quid in my bag. Put in the, <laughs> <laughs> Put in the votes on Tom now. Tip that. Thanks for calling out. the Big Brother vote lines. You have voted for Tom. This is... Go on, one more, one more. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, Let's for, go around for again. For Loughton. <laughs> People who can't vote, though, like Americans, they'll find this interesting. This, this one's for MSU. you. This is what happens. You dial the number and then you get a lot. Well, mate, this is for you. It's magic. Thanks for calling the Big Brother vote lines. You have voted for Tom. That's two people literally throwing their money away. Live <laughs> <there>. <laughs> that is an investment. Oh, shit, I just got my phone. I need my notes. Right, where are we okay, So then the next thing that happened was Raph did his garlic prank because he said, oh, I'm just going to do pranks from now on. And all my friends are just going to be so much fun doing pranks, having fun. So he puts the garlic in Hannah's pillowcase. Hannah finds out she's fucking disgusted, acting like a right moody cow about it because, you know, she's aggressive, got a chip on her shoulder, ex. So Dan Wooten said. Um, and don't. We no, talked I'm about Dan Wooten sarc- last week. Sarcastic. I don't want to keep talking about Dan Wooten. I hate him. Well, I heard he speaks very highly of you. And then <laughs> Hannah confronted Raph about it. And Raph said, absolutely noted. <laughs> oh, yeah. It was like... <laughs> Don't do that to me, yeah. basically. Hannah was very adamant with that mm. one. Um, before that, Andrew was in the dorm talking about Hannah. Do you remember Hannah? Um, they cut into Hannah sitting outside. She was sucking on this huge chunk of ice. Oh, I think you said she's sucking on a lemon. Oh, yeah, I wonder what That's that hilarious. was. hilarious. Yeah, I wonder what that was. <laughs> yeah, go on. But Andrew mm. did, in that dorm session, imply that her body language was aggressive. But he didn't quite say it, the word, but I knew what he was Pop getting at. kettle black. Uh, and here... Yeah, the drum, the hu- the humping section, which you mentioned earlier. Mm. I've noted that it had weird music over it. It was yeah. a musical edit, and then I've put trying to mimic Love Island. Maybe mm. this was something else that happened at the start of every segment of last night's well, show. You know shit about Love Island. And I tweeted saying I'm assuming this background music is something that Love Island do at the mm. start of every segment, and people were like, "Yep." Mm. Why is Big Brother trying to 
mimic Love Island. What's happened to your drink? The bubbles have gone out of my Prosecco. It was really bubbly earlier. It was really oh, mine's nice. still going. You just need a top up. Why have mine gone flat? No, we better not because we've never... we got a whole hour and a half Big Brother to watch. 